um, St. Lucia, one of the most beautiful places on God's green planet, right? Love St. Lucia. Um, talk a little bit about the difference between St. Lucia Carnival and, and Trinidad Carnival. What is the difference? Um, well, we all know Trinidad is the mecca of, of different carnivals. Number one, a, 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 sim, a, 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 a simple difference. The amount of shows that you would get on probably Carnival Friday in Trinidad would be probably our entire carnival for two weeks. You understand? Trinidad has the numbers. You know, Trinidad has the numbers. St. Lucia, you cannot have, like in Trinidad, right? You cannot have, you cannot have um, two events, two major events in St. Lucia at the same time. You understand? Everybody respects everybody. Everybody gives each other love. You know, so we we probably have about, you know, five to, to 9,000 people that party hard. You understand? So these people will go to different shows, but you can't have two major things in one night. You know, so that's a, a, a similar a, a, a difference. Um, our mass is not that big. We normally there together. We may not have too many numbers, you know. We'll have a good... 300 in a band, some bands, the, the, some bands like a thousand people or a thousand five hundred people, you know, compared to like a tribe of seven thousand, eight thousand. The numbers are just different, but the vibe in St. Lucia is just different and nice and easier, you know, and, and cooler and more relaxed and more chill, mm -hmm. you know? Look. That's just the difference. Beautiful. I've only been to St. Lucia once and I did the, the Jazz Fest, which was just mind blowing. That was incredible just the ambiance and this the beauty the majesty of the country and the people too the people so friendly the food so amazing and um yes. uh, right? and even when i think about it i get a tear in my eye right now because we're, we're there under lockdown so everything they're locked down right now right? yeah 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 <laughs> we 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 holding our weight right now um we're not really on too much of a lockdown but it's just restrictions on restrictions on different things that we can do numbers of course we can't have no parties we can't do this we can't do that you know but we i i just grateful to actually be home right now because saint lucia for me is one of the most safest places to be right now <laughs> you know i rather be here than be stuck in a cold somewhere and on, on an information law where you can't come out you can't do this you can't do that so i just came from the beach you know what i mean so yes <laughs> yeah. we're, we're very we're very envious <laughs> if that's the case yes then. come over <laughs> it's yeah. it's it's Christmas cold and I think it's snowing outside right now. But well, I'll send you some sun. Don't dig nothing. <laughs> Wanted to ask you. All right, so one of my favorite songs, Ale. We talked about it, prefaced it a little bit earlier. Um, kind of has a, an Afro vibes, kind of Zouk vibes. What was the influence behind that, and what do you attribute the, the worldwide success of that song to? I think Ale was one of the, the the most. Ale was my first positive song that I ever did. And uh, the reason why it became what it became is that everybody owned it as their personal get through, you know, their personal track to help them go through something. You understand? And with with the elements of, of, of the music, you know, I was able to do that song downstairs, my band room, you know, with my producer, you know, my keyboard player, you know, Peppy, you know, which it was in my band. And we just put our musical heads together you know, and, and, and created it. it. It was a, it was a, we were actually working on one song and then we decided to try to look for a bridge. And then when we went, when we went to the, the bridge of the song, we started, kun, 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 kun. and I was like, you know, shit, you know, that's a new song, you know? And then we, but I was only hearing the Ale Ale in my head, but Ale, Ale means, you know, to go, to move, you understand? But I just wanted to, to write it from a different point a view, you know, a different place that everybody could listen to and everybody can take it in. So I like to put a little bit of the French in there just to get people curious as to, okay, what's that word, you know, and then I explain it to you. And then from there, it became what it is. So I'm grateful. I woke up this morning and I feel it nice, but the path that I chose comes with battles to fight as long as i'm living my future is shaping and where i am heading got no time for problems hold the weight on your shoulder put the problems behind you if you fall long just get up and get your head out the dirt and when they try to bat my you and they talking behind you don't let nothing but
course, we're talking to, um, of course, recorded artists and superstar, call them big tunes on road, <laughs> shelling down the place, Tennis and John, of course, the pride of St. Lucia. And um, moving forward, 2021, um, what do you have to look forward to? I know you mentioned it, you hinted it just a little bit, working on a new album. Tell us a little bit more about that new album and, and 2021 for you. Albums, 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 albums. More, more, more content, you understand? More, even, hopefully, with everything happening. And they say they got a vaccine, which I don't trust, but that's another show. Um, but the, whatever, what happens, you know, hopefully we can get back on the road. But until then, I am going to keep on, you know, putting out content and putting out music for people to be able to love. On the 1st of January, I'm going to release my, my new, the first one that I'm going to release, you know, with a music video and all called Back to Love, Back to Basics. Back to Love. I love that. Back to Love 2021. There's a theme I actually might hang on to that. I might borrow that from you. Back to Love in 2021. Yeah. New music, big yeah. songs, a road for Teddy and John. Now, um, if someone wants to get in contact with you, they want to know more about you, they want to access, they want to get your music, they want to check the whole thing out, how do they How do they find you? You, you can follow me on my social media at Teddy and John. You understand? T E D D Y S O N J O H and Facebook, the same thing you can get at me. You understand? Twitter, the same thing you can get at me. You understand? I'm not that hard to find everything. You know, the the, the, the website www.tellusonjohn.com. You know, same thing. I love it. Family, I appreciate you taking this time to holler. I'm really excited to hear the, the, the uh, acoustic album. I haven't heard it yet, but again. But listen, that's what, that's what, right? I am going to send you the link for the entire concert, and you're free to show it on, on Viva TV. Yeah. And let me know, and I'll let everybody know that they can check it out. You're going to love it. I, I like that. I'm, of course, hollering. St. Lucia's Pride, Tennis and yeah. John in the building. Big tunes are shelling down, having some fun, interactive buzz all around the world and right into your living room. Kiri Lee Crawford, I got you locked in. Today, Tennis on Blessings, my family. All right. all right. Thank you so much. Make sure everybody go get the album. It's on all streaming platforms right now. Go buy it. Go tell a friend to tell a friend. Caribbean Moscato. Leave a message. You can tag me when you're listening to it. Let me know what you think. Hey, this is yours truly from the beautiful island of St. Lucia, Tedison John, and you are locked into FIFA TV. Yo, ka pale, pale, pale.